With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello students. So the question is, a short electric dipole is placed along y-axis at the origin. The electric field vector at a point P on the x-axis is E1. The electric dipole is rotated by pi by 2 at its position. Now the electric field vector at point P is E2. Select the correct alternative. So here in this question, let us assume the x and y axis here. This we assume x and y axis here. This is y axis and this is x axis. Now it is written dipole is placed along y axis. Suppose the dipole is like this here a and here b it is minus q and it is plus q the direction of dipole moment is negative to positive now we have to find the electric field at a point p on the x axis so the point p is here and this point p in first case will be equatorial point supports its distance from origin let us suppose it is d so we can write here the e1 vector will be equal to minus kp upon d cube why minus sign because the direction of electric field intensity will be opposite to the dipole moment this side right Next, we have to find, now that it is written that dipole is rotated by pi by 2. Now, if dipole is rotated by pi by 2, that means now the dipole will be at this position. Here will be A and here will be B. And we have to find the electric field at this point only. So, now this is, will be axial point. And the formula for axial point will be electric field intensity will be E2 is equals to here it is plus Q and here it is minus Q. Now the dipole moment direction is leftward. E2 will be equal to 2KP upon DQ. Here it is positive that means the direction of this is E1. The direction of E2 will be along P. That means this side. This is E2. Now it is clear from the figure E1 and E2 are perpendicular to each other. And if two vectors are perpendicular to each other, that means their angle is 90 degree. And if we find the value of E1 dot E2, then E1 dot E2 will be equal to E1 magnitude, E2 magnitude cos 90 and cos 90 will be 0. That means E1 into E2 is 0. So this indicates that option 4th is correct. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.